Hey, what's scratchy? I have so many options. Good morning, everybody, from the Epcot parking lot. Yay! It is 50 degrees out today. The wind chill is about 45, so. We bundled up today. We are bundled up, but today, me and Savannah are going to the Festival of the Arts. It is both of our first times here, yes? Yeah. It's our first time too, right? Yeah, I never did it. Um, I've never been in Disney this time of year, so. It's all fun and fresh. It's so new. Um, it opened, today is Tuesday. Oh my gosh, she has on an A.Hand. Yeah, I was literally just like that. that. <laughs> literally. Um, it just opened on the 17th, today is the 21st. So much we'll to learn. see how crowded it is. Um, we've looked a little bit at menus, but we're really just in for a big surprise, I think. Yeah. We're excited. Um, also, they're doing the Disney on Broadway, which I'm also thrilled yeah. about. Yeah. Um, tonight, there is two people from The Lion King, so most likely we'll have to check that out if we don't uh, freeze to death, but yeah. um, we were just looking at the schedule of everybody, and we just really need to see Carol Lindsay and Kevin Her Massey. Husband. Hello. Watch what happens, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome oh. to Epcot. It is windy. It is crazy. Yeah. I'm not loving it, but like Epcot. The flowers look nice. This looks like we're going into oh, camp. <laughs> like, actually, I think. Oh wait, no, but these are booths with art. Okay, wait, this is cool then. Okay, cool. I'm excited again. Festival of the Arts. Let's go. So right when you come into like the cross between. Future World, that's what this place is called, right? Yeah. Future World and World Showcase is where they have the huge mural that you can paint called Expression Section, which sounds like affection section. Sounds like in... expression section. Ooh, there it is. Um, but we're gonna come paint some stuff. It's exciting. I'm doing five squares yeah, of number eight. Doing... Oh, five squares of number seven. Let's go find some. Okay, you ready? I can do five squares, right? Yep. They have to be all next to each other. Should I do them not next to each other? Yeah, live life on the edge. I can't see anything, it's too sunny. Wow, you're really good at that. <laughs> That's a pretty green. What do you think it's gonna be? Um, probably Walt's head. Oh, we can only hope. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. That is the best square I've ever seen. Good job. Thank you. Okay. Oh, it's yellow. I thought it was green. So did I. <laughs> oh, you're such an artiste. <laughs> we painted some squares and they gave us these little things, which is, I think this is what it's going to look like. Because I see a lot of little circles on there, like maybe it's his eyes. Um, the lady said though that they change this out every two days. Like it gets filled, filled within two days. Oh, wait, you can see like my face on it. I know, I was gonna say, that one's like oh, kind of filled in. Cool. Look at him, that's cool. Great work, everyone. I know, we love that. This is gonna go on my map. Oh, it's a, it's a postcard. postcard, yeah. How fun. Not a wow, we love this. Epcot, Festival of the Arts. So while we're crossing over, I figured I'd show you some of the Festival of the Arts merch for this season. We got a Tervis. Wait, that's cute. Oh my gosh, we have reusable straws. Thank ah, you. With figment on them, how fun. Oh. Oh, I don't love silicone, silicone ones. Yeah. Don't love that. But save the turtles. Thank you. We got a little ornament. Oh, I like that. I like it has a little lid. That's <laughs> cool. <very> <laughs> a little coffee straw. We have this fancy purse of some sort. Wait, this luggage tag's cute. It's uh, an ornament. <laughs> luggage tag. I thought the same thing when well, I saw it. Heavy and I, I know. I was confused. What else do we have? Oh, we have shirts. I like this whole idea of Figment Color Co. Yeah, me too. Very Etsy. Hey, Figment yeah. plush. <laughs> oh. oh, are they reversible? No. No, like the... Yes, they are. Okay, well. Well. If you're into plastic centerpieces, this would be a perfect one. I think I'm going to opt out of those. <laughs> but they exist if you need them. Uh, wow. Go works. Tigers. <laughs> LSU! Yeah, go Tigers! I like that one if it didn't have a huge figment in the middle of it. I would sleep good in it. Oh, same. I would sleep good with figment. This is in casket action, so I'm there. There you go. All right, we're continuing into World Showcase. That's all the merch they have over here. Um, would love to know if there's any pins, because if there is, then I need to buy one. Oh, those little photo ops, I forgot about these. I see these on Instagram every year. Oh, this is okay. fun. Um, also, we're not doing it, but they have the animation. Yeah, in, it's in the theater in America. America. I don't know if I told you yeah. that. It's like literally in the theater. Um, but it's only at 12.30 and 1.30, and it's already well, like 1.30. Right so, miss that, maybe next time. Wine? 
we have Which one is it? it? We're about to do this fun photo op. We waited entirely too long in this line for this. <laughs> I thought it was going to be like three minutes. It was a at solid, least at least 10 minutes, yeah. Um, and these pictures won't be seen by the public. Oh god, no. Maybe if they're really extra good, um, we'll put some on the screen, we'll see. <laughs> You'll see them on Twitter. Please. Yeah, on Twitter. So they have these chalk art pieces. Wait! Dude, I can not even play. Look at Grumpy! Wait, they're working on a gun here. I want to look. It's Remy. That's for you, Caitlin. <gasps> Miguel! Look at that smile. Oh my god, he's so happy. He's got some white teeth. His highlight is popping. Yeah, it is. <gasps> oh my gosh, I see Elsa. <laughs> oh my god! Okay. Oh, bro, bro. for me and of course we have Anna and Elsa too. Ouch! Look at Bruni! Y'all look how freaking cool this is. What the heck? This place is awesome. Windy, but we took some extra some rainbows. Let's go! We have music over here too which is cool. There's a man playing a harp. Wait so when I was a kid I, my mom asked me what kind of instrument I wanted to play because I had mastered the violin. <laughs> And I said, sure, Jan. Okay, <laughs> whatever you say, Katie. Um, and I said, I wanted to play the harp. And so for about for like three months, I looked to find a harp so I could start playing it. That's um, crazy. And I, lost it. I like lost it just in the harp and picked up the flute and played that for three months. Didn't have lung capacity. Fun fact, Didn't I played the flute for a solid seven years. Wow. Yeah. I played it for three months. That's crazy. But I did play the violin for seven years. I played the violin for two years. So, oh, wait, we're at our first booth. Ah! Do we need some food? Probably. Let's see. White oh, I need that cookie. Pigment puzzle of an artist on an artist palette. I need the cookie. Here's some pics of what we want to get. I need that cookie. Yeah. Wow, yeah. Enjoy. I love that. Thank you. It's art. All right. Well, yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. That's so fun. What are you gonna pay? <laughs> Myself. I got the chocolate chip cookie, which smells phenomenal. What did you get? A uh, lemon, a lemon tart. tart. Yeah. It looks good. It looks so cute. Look at all that. I, I like it. What it is? We'll find out. I know that. Oh, it's just like mousse. No, um, like confectioner sugar and milk. Oh, it's like that kind of icing. Am I supposed to paint something? Oh, I like it. Mm -hmm. It's cute. It's a big cookie. Yeah, this is literally her size. Here's my hand. Here's that cookie. It's bigger than my hand. This is the tart. Oh. What's it coming out of it? Oh. It's like oozing. <laughs> it's really good though. Taste it. What, what is this food? It's like no flavor to it. Great. Maybe. I like it. Let me try this. Mm. I love that. This is a little crunchy thing. I want to try this one. Oh. There's a meringue on it. Mm -hmm. What was it? Like hard candy? Uh, regret. Oh. I like yours better than mine. Is your cookie hard? Uh uh, it looks kind of bland. Dip it in the color. It's good. Shock chip. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and just paint it a little bit. I can make some green. Look at that, I made green. This is like white chocolate or something. I don't like white chocolate. My cookie! Size wise, five out of five. Yeah. Taste wise, I mean, three out of five. Like it's cookie, yeah. It's like a subway. Mm -hmm. I wish it was warm. Not warmed. Yeah. yeah. But like, the paint would go everywhere, I guess. Yeah. I would give yours like four and a half out of five. Yeah, I'm not mad at all. I really like it. I like the, what would Colleen say? R.I.P. She would call it the, like a sweet surprise. <laughs> We're passing the deconstructed dish. And this is one that a lot of people, because I asked on Twitter like, hmm, ever been here before? Tell me what I need to know. Um, this was one that a lot of people recommended. They have a deconstructed Reuben, BLT, and cheesecake. I just don't need any more dessert because I ate one and that's my max. Oh, but I need the churros. We're gonna have to wait. We're I can't eat them right now. I literally can't. Um, we didn't even eat half of what we got. No, we ate maybe half. 
Um, what else Wait, do they have though? Artists over here. Poutine, Wait, lobster, lobster chips. chips. I don't think what that's specialty. That? No, but like I'm... I wish there were buffalo chicken chips from yeah. Animal Kingdom. I think that that's what I was really wanting them to be. Yeah. No. Sad. Um, but yeah, the deconstructed stuff, I just don't eat Rubens or BLTs, so like that makes it tricky for me. De uh, deconstructed breakfast drink, which it was like the was twinnings risky, like shake, which yeah. I like that at Food and Wine. Um, so probably would have liked it, but like you know, can't want them all today. <laughs> what I have quickly learned about this festival through just living through the passport and looking at like the three booths is everything. I feel like is very exotic, which I think is good because it like changes it up from the stuff they normally have at World Showcase. Yeah, but it's just a little too exotic for me. Which is sad because I don't eat seafood, I don't eat pork. So makes it hard. Really like a oh, these are you can design your own. I want a tiny shirt. Can I have a oh tiny my gosh! Shirt? And you can pick out your fit. Hmm. What picture would you put on it? <laughs> Johnny Depp. <laughs> oh, good choice. Taking a picture at the Mermaid Lagoon and Skull Rock one because you know, whips for Peter Pan. Something I forgot about until I saw a bunch of people. Um, with their phones out taking pictures of it, is in all of the countries they have like a, some sort of art piece like painted on the walls. It's Peter Pan. Peter. I don't know how this this got decided, but um, <laughs> for some reason we're just taking a picture at all of these little photo booth things. So we just did the one in France. It's really good. <laughs> it's really really good. Um, they have something here that everybody says is good, the free oh, bread bowl thing. But yeah. I just like I'm confused as to how I'm supposed to eat it. It's, it's just a lot. You know what? So in Disneyland, they have bread bowls everywhere. Yeah. And only it's soup in it. This is just melted. Literally, it's just cheese. But like, could be good. <sighs> Should we get it? Maybe. Wait, didn't we need the macaroons? They're just so expensive. Yeah, they are. That's another thing that I have noticed about this oh, festival. Yeah. Um, Because we don't get a discount here. Is everything is very expensive. Like most things are over eight dollars. Yeah, even for just like wine's like four dollars. Like, yeah, most things are like between I would say like four to six. And here everything's between like seven and nine, which I don't love. But you know, it'd be like that. That is my children. Berlioz, 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 and Marie. Oh my God, they're so. Cute. These are cool. We're in America now. Pottery. I like that one. My dad would have that in his house. So something Sav and I are noticing, which we said we appreciate about America because they had a lot, is we wish there was more like, it's not interact. Is it interactive? Is that the I word? Think it's still interact. Like something going on. Yeah, not like just, like a tent with art some art you can look at. Yeah, like America had um, two people that were like making art right then and there. Um, okay, <laughs> oh my god, oh my yeah. god, we have to do this one. Mr. George Washington. I love flash. that. Oh my god, this is amazing. Um, Morocco had, you could do spin art, which is like kind of lame, so but like it's something. Um, and now we're gonna come and do this Washington Crossing the I'll Delaware. Honest, this is the best part. <laughs> Literally, these, this is the best part. What did we find at the festival, Bronwyn? Ha. Um, this really rare delicacy um, called the Lotus Blossom Cafe. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's brand very new to the festival this year. Brand new this year. Um, very artsy. Very artsy. I love like the aesthetic of it. You can't beat it. Mm -hmm. Big fan. Yeah. So they have one of the little photo booths um, in Mexico and it's Frida Kahlo and it gives you the like um, unibrow and I'm going to make Savannah do it. Because it just looks so much like It's your twin. Turn, go ahead. Oh yeah, this is it. <laughs> there we go. Ready? One, two, three. What happened? You're making a mess. Okay. This is from Poppies. Oh, I like it. She's yummy. Oh, good. Sky black cherry the breeze. It does not have alcohol in it. Yeah. And your lipstick too. <laughs> Tastes like something I would like. Right? Yeah. It tastes like um, kind of like cough syrup, but good. <laughs> it tastes like a uh, snow cone syrup. Yeah, that's why I like it. It's also 50 degrees, and you're drinking a frozen drink, but I won't say anything. It's fine. I wanted the frozen coffee that comes with a donut at Joffrey's, but I know that I don't like Joffrey's, so I didn't get it. Look at Minnie. Oh my what? God! Hello, oh my, my dress. 
Okay, so we made it to the front of the World Showcase again. And I think we're done. <laughs> I think we did everything we need to do. We're gonna give a better review of this festival once we're Probably in the car. Probably in the car. Yeah, we're warm. It's chilly and it's just hard. Yeah. Um, um, but we're gonna try to take more pictures by the rainbows because yeah, it's yeah. hopefully not as. Windy. They weren't our best work. Not my best work. Not at all. Like, it's not really like salvageable. Right. So we'll try again. I think I gave myself a nose job because. <laughs> Persons just weren't working. Literally. Okay, here we are at the beginning. We're going to take more pictures. Bye. Hi, everybody. Um, we're not in Epcot. Welcome to our humble abode. Um, we, yeah. So we got a little cold. So we came home. We did all the festival stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, like we did everything we wanted to do, I guess. Um, but we just wanted to give a quick little update on our thoughts of the festival as first-time participants. Experience. Yeah. yeah. Um. In the you start. <laughs> <laughs> so I had very high hopes for this festival. Like I just thought this was gonna be my new favorite. It just sounded something that was just very much gonna be up my alley. Yeah. I had bad FOMO last year when yeah. everyone was doing it and I wasn't there. Went to and like it looks so cute. It's cute. Instagram makes it look really yeah. cute. Yeah. Good job, guys. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. It's just there isn't a there's lot not much going to on. it. Like I feel like, and I said this earlier to Savannah, like if food and wine is the one you like the best, which is, and that's like the one I've experienced the most, um, everything else just like <laughs> pales in comparison pretty yeah. much. Like, um, and I think for me at least with the festivals, like I expect like great food and like things to do. Yeah. And, and it just, in your face wasn't it I it was, felt very stop and go yeah. the whole festival like there's this huge section like when we first got there with all the like chalk stuff and there was pictures and i was like this is so cool and you then i walk like, into world showcase and there's a huge stage with yeah. performers and, and then and it then just like nothing died yeah. after that um if you have a lot of money and you are going there to find to the buy art. disney art it's there yeah um i was explaining it like you could go to any big city and go to a art festival and there's more to see and do yeah. and like to be impressed by and like i was expecting huge like art pieces that were done specifically artwork for not, this. yeah like artwork that wasn't just like to, to purchase buy. on a canvas yeah i wanted there to be like it to take up a big piece of space and like yeah. look really cool and there was nothing like that and the food was interesting like i know that i'm a picky eater so yeah. like but even like with food and wine i can normally like finesse with like and get something at just about every booth yeah there was like Three maybe things. two booths yeah. that i was like i could even consider eating that there's a couple desserts that i was like yeah i could eat that but like i don't mm. i didn't want to eat 10 desserts like i ate that cookie and i was like i'm good um maybe it's just like art pe artsy people like fancy weird food but, but, I, like but i feel like I'm a very artsy person. If they have person. some ratatouille, I feel like that's artistic. Like, it looks beautiful. It's visually yeah. pleasing to the eye. That's the kind of thing I thought they would have. Maybe some sherbet. I don't know. Something. But, like... Even, I mean, I... Even at food and wine, like, I don't really care that much about the alcohol just because, like... I don't want to spend $12 on a... On half a glass champagne, of yeah. champagne. Yeah. But even, like, the alcohol I wasn't impressed by. And, like, they didn't really have any, like specialty stuff it was just like the normal like here's a florida beer yeah i'm like okay what's what's festival the artsy about that like right. nothing also we did not see a single trading pin no the festival. yeah they're i don't know if they don't have one or what yeah. because there's no way they're sold out because this festival started three days ago given they we don't really have like a true merchandise location right now so but we even went into the sketchy little mouse gear which that looks like it's awful one night <laughs> That's just that's, a, that's for a different story. That's a whole other thing. Uh, yeah, that wasn't great. Um, but they didn't have anything in there, and like they had tons of the other stuff that I was like, "There's no way that they're actually sold out." Also, every piece of Festival of the Arts merchandise that I saw had Figment on it, and I love Figment. I'm I a like big Figment. fan. I think he's so cute. I would have liked there to be like Some, something, and it's not even just like Figment's on everything. It's like his face is bigger he than my head on the shirt. front of my shirt yeah yeah like and everything has them on it because you can make it save festival of the arts you can make it disney without like having to have like a that yeah I like and it's nothing with fig like 
It could be Mickey Mouse and I would think yeah. the same thing. Like I just don't love when there's just like a They had like a, a little station thing. where you could make shirts, which I thought was cute. Yeah. Like you can press the little thing and you decide your design and you could get tie-dye and things like that. Yeah. That was cute. They had a few places like They had that, they had the spin art. They had the spin art. I know they have an animation class, we just didn't do it. Yeah. But it has to be really big because they do it twice a day and it's in the American Pavilion, which is that, a like giant the American theater. Garden Theater or whatever. Like the thing is huge. Yeah. But I feel like that's just got to be tricky. Yeah. I don't but, like, know. we got some good picks. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know. It was very windy today. Mm -hmm. It was chilly. But, like, I, I have a pick I'm going to post on Insta. So, like, you guys are going to think we, had, we loved it. But, like, it was just a good pick. Literally. Um, we wanted to stay for the Disney Broadway stuff. But, like, is that part of Festival of the Arts or is that just its yeah. own thing? No, it's part of Festival of the Arts. Um, I love that. But... There literally just like was nothing else for us to do there. Yeah. Like we did a lap around the world showcase and I was like, Don't it's not even like, it again. no, there wasn't anything where I was like, oh, I wish I could get this, but I'm not hungry for it. Yeah. Like, I was like, oh, I think I'll be okay if I don't spend $12 on macaroons. Literally. I don't know. Everything. That was another thing that I noticed, which I think I said earlier, everything seemed very expensive. Yeah. Like significantly more expensive than any other because even like i mean festival of the holidays just got done and like stuff wasn't that excruciating like no like no. so it's i don't even think it's like mm, everything's raising prices like it was no. anything that i was like oh yeah maybe i'll get that it was like almost ten dollars yeah. and i was like i'm gonna go get a full meal for that much we like, thought about getting like the bread bowl because i was like oh i like brie yeah. like it's pro i probably would that'd like, be like the only thing that we were gonna eat but it was Eight dollars for a Hawaiian $8. roll with melted cheese. <laughs> literally, <laughs> like, um, there was in Germany. They had a some like Keep your thing. Yeah, I'd it's like a, to take a look at it. Really, we'll just do a full review right I here. I have mine literally in my pocket right now. Uh, I didn't do any of the stickers. We didn't get anything. <laughs> I got that cookie, and that was about it. The cookie was good. The things I did get, I liked. Yeah. Well. What did I get? I got a cookie. I literally got a lemon tart. <laughs> yeah, I got a cookie and, got and a oh, and some egg rolls from Lo which weren't even part of the thing. Um, let's see. I just don't understand. A lot of it, and maybe it's them just trying to like, they gotta fill up the festival with something. There was a lot of seafood. Like I feel like a lot of stuff was like salmon or I saw scallops. Scallops, I yeah, saw, yeah. Why can't I find anything? Aaron Delacqua lemonade. Thank you. <sighs> God. Um, um, that looked like something if I ate any of the stuff on it, I would have liked it. There's no pictures or anything. No. This is just, I really like food and wine. I think my heart is just sense. Sense. But I had a great time at Festival of the Holidays, too. Like, I went multiple times and yeah. got, like, multiple different things from each place. I Even, don't need to go back. <sighs> what are my thoughts on flower We food? took really good pictures in the photo booth. <laughs> And that was oh, probably yeah. the highlight of my day. Literally. Because it was just like, how obnoxious I even, can this be? I honestly even expected more of that. Yeah. Like, because I've seen all that stuff on social media. Yeah. That I was like, oh my God, they must just be everywhere. And I was like, there was like four of them in the yeah. whole showcase. And I was like, And okay. they, there was never a line. No. Were, like, it was literally them waiting for somebody to take pictures there. And like, again, I wish they just had like tapestries or like a huge canvas yeah. of things that they created specifically for this festival i'm pulling up our pictures i don't know when i was in new york there was an art festival literally in the streets in like four blocks and there was just so much to look at so much going on there were things catered to new york city but like yeah. this oh, was God. just uh, <laughs> oh they come with videos thank god i'd like to see me as the mona lisa <laughs> okay what about my blinking in? So that's good. But he was like, point that way when we were with George Washington. And I didn't. <laughs> Why are you standing like that? <laughs> oh, God. What is that? <laughs> What's the video? It's not doing it. It just plays music. <laughs> that's really good. I'm glad that that's a video. <laughs> <laughs> Someone want to buy our photo pass so we could have that? Literally. It was an annual I pass. Never. We look so good. Just two girls. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Do they 
all have this awful song. So, in conclusion, um, it was fine. Go. Go. Yeah, definitely. Like, I'm glad that I went. Like, I don't yeah. regret going. And if somebody was like, hey, do you want to go to Festival of the Arts? I'd be like, yeah, sure. I need another pick by the rainbow. Exactly. But I just don't see myself, like, running back to it. Out. And I don't think I would ever go by myself. Oh, no. There's nothing to do. There's nothing. Um, but if you are a bit more adventurous with food and like trying really unique food, then you're probably going to really like it. Yeah. And if I you just, have $200 for a canvas painting of Mickey Mouse, then there it is. You know what? Today's your lucky day. Agave <laughs> pork belly pork belly. <laughs> <laughs> this is, so I'm just going to read you some of the random this things here. So Mexico good. has agave pork belly. Pork belly caramelized with agave atop pumpkin seed pesto lentil salad. No. Um, and it's probably fourteen dollars. Literally, yeah. This doesn't have prices in it. They did have a plant-based bratwurst that I thought maybe I should try, but we had eat, just eaten an egg roll, yeah. and they have the paintbrush churros, which I wanted, but you know. Um, oh, that does have ratatouille. Braised ratatouille. Come for me. I didn't know. The only other thing that I thought maybe I could eat was in Germany the red wine braised beef short rib with parsnip puree, broccolini, baby tomatoes, and aged balsamic. Sounds normal. Um, yeah, what was, there was something that was like really expensive. It was like $14. Oh. What was it? I don't remember what it was. I don't know, but we were like, oh, maybe we would eat that. But they have a little sushi donut. If you like sushi, literally, like that's fine. Beef noodles, $12. And yeah. it's two of us, these. And they were trying to sell macarons in. Macarons. Those ones are macarons. Macaroons are the coconut ones. I call them macaroons, but you know, trying to be like authentic. Nine dollars for three of them. I said, in what world? I paid five dollars for a chocolate chip cookie the size of my head. Not even five dollars. I think it was like four. It's a good cookie. Um, yeah, I think just weird. Chewbacca. <laughs> Chewbacca. <laughs> Chewbacca. 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 Oh, God. Wow, mushroom risotto. Seven hundred and sixty-two dollars. <laughs> Zinderfall. Latte and donut pairings. Oh, they had different ones. Different what? Like that one was the Baroque oh. pairing. They had a Renaissance and a modern okay, and an impression. Joffrey's. I bet you would like that, and what I could have eaten the Camel? donut. Nope, blueberry. I just want a blueberry donut. Okay, so you like it, and I'd buy it. <laughs> so I like doing this thing because you get free stuff. This is what it was for Festival of the Arts. Deconstructed BLT, don't eat that. Almond cake. <laughs> Frankapani. <laughs> Frankapane. <laughs> the, the one that looks, it's the Andy Warhol one. I could have eaten that. Seared Corvina, no. Pan seared scallops, no. Vanilla rose water and pistachio panna cotta, no. I heard Tim Tracker talk like talk about that, and he made it sound like it's like the Mario Badescu spray. <laughs> <laughs> like, I imagine that's what it would taste like. Literally, because he's like, it tastes like rose water, and all I could think of is that's like, what I spray my face like rose water and aloe. <laughs> that's so silly. Yeah. Um, I did enjoy the paint by number mural though. That was a nice little fun thing. Yeah, that took 32 seconds though. Exactly. Um, so overall, I would give the festival a. We should have categories. <laughs> Food. Food was a one out of five. five. Mm, Ambiance, one out of five. One out of five. There was nothing going on. Uh, honestly, it was popping in Future World. That's true. Oof. I thought Future World was better than World Showcase. Yeah, but which, there was nothing in Future World. Yeah. Um, activities were like subpar. It just wasn't. I expected. It wasn't more. artsy. No, like it, it was sold fine. Art. Yeah, that what it was. and that was it. And I feel like the food also wasn't that. The desserts, I feel like, were kind of artsy. Like, they had yeah. some fancy desserts. But, like, food wise, I was like, it's just a normal meal. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Still go. Still check it out. Yeah. You'll have a good time. Yeah. You're not going to be miserable. Have good company. Yeah. I just. Make a silly time. Take some good pics. Mm -hmm. I'm just good. Took, yeah. That's fine. Yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed this vlog of Festival of the Arts, and you're so excited to go now. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Just wanted to give you our honest opinions on it because I right. try and be like We're authentic very and not just like, wow, it was great when I had a the best mediocre thing I've time. Ever done. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um, now we're gonna make peanut butter and jelly cookies. Yeah, more like I'm just gonna watch Savannah make them because I think I just need to sit. But I'm gonna have her perform Frozen 2, the sing along by Some her. things 
never change. Like how I'm holding on tight to you. Bye, everyone. Bye. <laughs>